they're like a force of nature. It's not even a band, it's a force of nature. And that's what's amazing about them is they have this ability to adapt, yet still be themselves. Adding a stand-up bass, yeah, that sounds a little bit crazy, you know, on the surface. But if you saw the shows, you realize, hey, it's a Melbourne show. It looks different, it sounds a little different, but it's still the same um, animal. I had left Alternative Tentacles, and I was managing uh, Mike Patton and uh, Mr. Bungle and, and all Mike's other band. I had three or four records that had no home that I didn't want to sell to any other label. Didn't feel comfortable with it. So me and Greg, uh, my partner at Ipecac, were like, Let's start a label, fuck it. I just contacted some distribution people and we kind of set it up to where we would put Phantomas out ourselves. And then I told Buzz, I told all the guys from Phantomas, here's how we're gonna do it, we're just gonna do it ourselves. And, and Buzz was like, oh really? Interesting, well, what, what are you doing for distribution? And I was like, well, we've got Caroline in the US, we've got Southern in Europe, um, we've got shock in Australia, so we've got the world kind of covered, so, you know, we're going to see how it goes. It's like, because the Melvins don't have a home. What really made it, the label sort of take shape was when we told Buzz, hey, we may be starting this label. He's like, hey, I got four records, you can have them. Bam. Oh my God, you know, here we go. We weren't even really thinking at that time of being a real record label. We were kind of just going to be an outlet for Mike's, all Mike's products. So like, if we have the Melvins, we're going to be a real record label. So the Melvins, in a sense, became the backbone, you know, besides my stuff, uh, of, the, of, the, of the label. We were trying to decide on what to call our label, and it was Buzz that suggested Ipecac. And I, at the time, I didn't know what it was. Mike knew what it was, and was like, oh yeah, that's great, you know, that makes people sick, just like our music. 